Uh, we are going to do one programming exercise. So basically it's a single exercise. That's the continuation of my previous, yeah, previous program. So in previous video, I discussed about generating a random number between an interval, a minimum and maximum interval. But in this video, I am going to discuss about how you will generate a six digit random number. So this is the topic for the discussion today. And we all know that how we can generate a random number. We will use the random class, then we will uh, use the next int or something to generate an int number right that's already i did here so everyone can see that so next gen is the method we are going to use the next gen digit then after that what we will do for uh, generating a six digit number that's the first thing so here if we are uh, having a programmatic approach um, and we need to convert that particular uh, six digit number into a, a character, six character actually. We need to format that using the format string dot format. So what we will do here is like, we will generate six digit int, then we will format that using format that using string format okay so that's we are going to do in this program so here I can actually print something and uh, I'm going to generate next in six digit okay okay so basically i'm going to generate digit six so how i can do that i can use the same random class then next change so this is very easy actually and i need to mention that six digits here so we usually use okay so this one one two Three, four, five, six. It's going to be seven. So I just make it. Okay. Then what I am going to do is I will print then this one. Okay. So inside that string do format and next what we need is like the formatting stone so it's very easy 0 60 and then we need to mention the number is so number digit 6 so let's see whether it's going to work or not just make sure whether it's working or not okay one two three four five six so it's working fine yeah so under the generating i'm not sticking into one program so that's for for today so tomorrow i will come with some other topics so basically this is a very easy program to generate random numbers but yes we will encounter some specific scenarios so that is why I am discussing this kind of things. So minimum, maximum, I discussed in my previous video. If you guys not aware of that, just go to my channel and go back to one of the previous videos, and there we will get uh, a video regarding this one. Minimum, maximum. Okay, thank you for watching. Have a nice day.